sold us this idea that I'm supposed to be a millionaire overnight, that I'm supposed to have a successful business overnight, that I'm supposed to have a six pack overnight, that I'm supposed to have the greatest marriage that's ever been seen overnight. And that is not true. The truth of the matter is that greatness takes time. Success takes time. If you are gonna have the body of your dreams, that six pack bicep, tricep, it's gonna take time. Time in the gym, time eating right, time. If you are going to have the business that's blowing up, that everybody's looking at and hiring people, it's gonna take time. If you are gonna have the mindset and if you're gonna have the legacy that's gonna last, the legacy where you can pass something down to your children's children's children, it is going to take time. And my challenge with this generation, my challenge with our current culture is we are trying to rush. We want everything now. And if it doesn't come quick, and if it doesn't come in a hurry, we will abandon it. If our dream isn't accomplished in two weeks, we're done. If the relationship doesn't give us goosebumps quickly, we're done. Anything that seems like it's gonna be tedious or like it's gonna take long or like it's gonna be a difficult time, we will totally escape it, get away from it and abandon it. And many of us are missing out on golden opportunities because we don't want to take the time to go through the process. It takes time. It takes practice. It takes failure. It takes getting up. It takes you trying it again. It takes doors closing. It takes people walking out. It takes time for you to get to your success. There is no such thing as an overnight success. There is no such thing as just, you just got lucky. No, you gotta put in the work. And the hard truth about life is that it's gonna take time, which means you cannot rush this process. It means that you gotta slow down and it means you have to appreciate where you are while also looking forward to where you're going. It means you're gonna have to appreciate where you are while also looking forward to where you're going. But you cannot ignore the small successes and the small wins because you just have your mind on I gotta win now. This is preparation time, come on. This time allows you the opportunity to get yourself together. Everything you're supposed to have, it's gonna come to you in time. At the perfect time, you're gonna find that beautiful bride. At the perfect time, all those clients, you're gonna be ready to handle. At the perfect time, you're gonna see your staff come together. At the perfect time, that house is gonna come and it is not gonna overwhelm you. At the perfect time, you're gonna see elevation in your life. So the hard truth about life, success takes time. Greatness takes time. But if you wait for the right time, I promise your moment's gonna show up and you're gonna be ready to handle everything that God has for you. We are gonna talk the truth today. The truth of the matter is some of the stuff you want, you're not ready for. You're not ready for employees. You can barely wake up in the morning yourself. You're not ready for a staff. For some of you, you're not ready for marriage. I know you say you want to be married. I just, if I just had somebody, truth be told, if you had somebody, you drive them crazy because you drive yourself crazy. Maybe you're not ready for the house yet. You barely take care of your room and you say, where the house? The house is not coming because God said you're not ready for the house. You don't take care of your bike. What makes you think you're ready for a car? Maybe, maybe you haven't arrived yet because you're not ready. Maybe you're not ready for it. And I know that everyone's supposed to tell you you're ready and you can have it and you can do it. And I got you, I got you. But it's gonna take time because time gives you an opportunity to get prepared for the promise.
I said time gives you the opportunity to get prepared for the promise. Maybe you need a little bit more time to work on your patience. Maybe you need a little bit more time to work on your, your understanding of this area or your understanding of this field. Maybe you need a little more time to develop your character. Come on, somebody. Maybe you need a little bit more time. Time. Why are you rushing to get keys to a car you can't fit into yet? Why are you rushing to get keys for something you don't know how to drive? The reason why my son can't get the keys to his car right now, because he's five. He's going to have to wait. I'm going to have to see my son. He's going to have to get a little taller for this. I, I'm, I'm going to need to see him get his permit first. I'm going to need to see him going ahead and get his license. He needs to go through some driving school. He needs to drive, even when he does become of age and get his permit, I still got to drive with him in the car next to him to make sure he don't crash. <laughs> Hear me, when you get something too early, you might crash. When you get something you can't handle, you might crash. When you get something too early that you're not ready for, you might crash. So maybe God knows what he's doing. Maybe you need to calm down because God knows what he's doing. He knows that you need time. 